Hey guys, Zonico, welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a super exciting video. I'm going to be doing another collaboration with Poshmark, except this time it's going to be a little bit different. Ew, that sounded so beauty guru-y. That was so ugly. So today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. I'm pretty sure I've never done something like this on my channel, but I'm going to be decluttering my clothes. So I just moved houses and it's kind of hectic. There are a lot of clothes everywhere. So I tried to get most of my shirts together and we're going to be decluttering that. I feel like I made a lot of good progress. I'm really excited. and. If you saw a shirt that you like, you can go check it out on my Poshmark, which will be right here. I love Poshmark. They have awesome brands like Nike and Adidas. And it's not just me. Like, I feel like I'm probably going to be selling some shit stuff, but you can find some really dope stuff on Poshmark. So go check it out. Let's go to the video. Okay, so this is my shirt drawer. I just moved, so I don't really know what's going to be in this drawer. I don't know. Let's just get started. First, I have this shirt from Zappel, I'm pretty sure. It's really cute. I think I'm going to keep this hoe. <laughs> Another shirt from Zappel, which I think it's good to have two tops, but I've literally never worn this once. And I've had it for like three months, and I haven't worn it once. But, uh, but I want to keep it. It's cute. I'm going to, no, I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep it. This tube top I love. It's from Urban. It's one of their like classic tube tops. I think it's such a staple to have. I want to get one in black too. I'm definitely going to keep that even though it's so expensive. Oh my god, this shirt I actually thrifted from this thrift store chain in Massachusetts called Buffalo Exchange and it's from Oh Mighty which is a super expensive website but I love this shirt. I think it's so cute. Keeping that. Oh my god. <laughs> this is not off to a great start. I feel like. I'm going to keep this tube top as well. Oh my god, I feel like this is so bad. I'm going to keep this hoe. This is really cute. This is from So Aesthetic, I'm pretty sure. This doll's kill top. I love it. says devil. I got it because Tana Mojo wore it in her W music video. I'm taking the She looked so bomby in that. I bought literally the outfit that she was wearing in it because she looked so good. I'm taking L's. This I'm actually going to declutter. I bought this so long ago. It's a bandeau from PacSun and it's reversible. It has like palm trees on the inside and then this on the outside. I'm going to sell it. I don't really know. Probably don't. This is the top half to this two-piece set from Zaffle that I have and I think it's so cute. And then this skirt. This skirt to a Zaffle set I have. Let's see if I can find the top. I can't find the top right now. I think I'm going to keep this to I think this is from Zappo. I think this is really cute even though this is literally the hoeiest shirt ever. I'm gonna keep that though. This I literally just got from Dolls Kill. It still has a tag on it, but it just doesn't fit me. The chain is too long and it's really confusing. So I think I might give it to somebody else. It's like a bandana style top, but it has like money signs on it. So I'm gonna declutter that. And then I'm also gonna declutter this other Zappo shirt. I thought it was cute at first and honestly I thought it was cute when I ordered it. I even put it in a Zappo try on video and I thought it was really cute, but I just have not worn it and it looks weird on me this shirt I got in like seventh grade I still have it I used to think it was so cute it's from forever 21 it says Chicago Bulls I don't even know what sport that is NBA really the Bulls are a basketball team huh it's cute and comfortable, so I might donate it. It's in good condition, but yeah, I'm over it. This shirt, oh, this is one of my favorite shirts that I own. It's also from Urban Outfitters, but with one of their, like, classic bralettes, it's just so cute. Like, you can see the bralette in the back. It's just, like, crop top, lace up on the side. I don't think they sell it anymore, but that's, like, why I want to keep it. It's one of my favorite shirts ever. It's so soft, too. Yeah, when I was in seventh grade, I was really obsessed with shirts with this kind of neckline. This one is also from Forever 21. My mom says that necklines like these look really good on me, but I don't like them. Here, wait, let me try it on. No, I'm gonna keep this hoe. Wow. I haven't worn it in like a year and a half. I have this Space Jam shirt. It's also from Forever 21. I used to like to wear it without like any pants, but now I'm too tall, so I don't really like it because it doesn't look good when you're wearing pants. It only looks good as like a big t-shirt and then like with some high heels or like thigh highs. So I think I'm gonna sell that because maybe somebody would like to wear it with pants. This shirt, I'm gonna keep. It's just this pink shirt. It's a v-neck. It's really comfortable and when I wear a push-up bra, it's like the v-neck is like at a perfect angle so it makes my boobs look like really good gonna keep that oh my tommy hilfiger bodysuit i have to keep this they also came out with another one that's like it's like plain on the front and then it has like navy blue crisscross straps in the back this shirt from target is actually so cute i wore this on my first day freshman year it's just like so casual i don't know it's really really comfortable i'm gonna keep that too i hate myself Ooh, this shirt i love it's also from oh mighty but i bought this one straight from the website i didn't thrift it i love oh mighty like a woman does not have to be modest in order to be respected i love this shirt um 
I got it in eighth grade when like my dress code was really bad and I was really against it and all my friends were too. I'm just like really not for dress codes. I think that they're dumb. This shirt is also from Zaffo. It's really cute and really like casual. I used to wear it a lot, but I feel like now that I just have so many shirts, I don't really need it. It's just kind of like a basic shirt. You give it that. This Slut Ever shirt from American Apparel. I also got this from Buffalo Exchange. It's so cute. I have to keep it. I literally haven't worn it because these, the sides go out too far and it looks weird, but I just, I can't get rid of it. I was so proud of myself for finding a shirt that said Slut Ever on it. Like, I have to keep it. I have to. I have to. This shirt is from Forever 21. I really like it. It kind of gives me like an art ho vibe. It has like a very, very slight turtleneck right here. And I like wearing this with like mom jeans and a belt. I just feel like that looks really bomby. So yeah, it's super soft. I think it was like eight bucks. Like Forever 21 has really cute clothes. Another top to a two-piece Savile set that I'm gonna keep. I'll put a picture of me wearing it right here. It's really cute. That one has really cute two-piece sets. And I love two-piece sets because it's like the outfit is done. Like you have to just decide what two-piece set you're gonna wear, but you don't have to like match the top to the bottom. Oh, here's the top to that skirt. It doesn't really fit me, but I might give it to Corey, the outfit, because she liked it, I remember. This shirt from So Aesthetic. Oops, I didn't even put this in my haul. <laughs> Yikes. It just doesn't fit me at all. It's way too big. This shirt I got from Forever 21. It's really confusing. It used to have like a, like a, oh wait, I made this cute. It used to have like a string tying these together and it got really tangled and it was really ugly. So I took the string out and that's like kind of cute. I could even wear this like in the front instead of the back because I kind of like the little loops. Huh. I kind of fuck with that. We'll keep it. Give it a shot. This little velvet baby pink crop top. Very cute. It's just a staple. I have like this in black and in pink. This is a leotard that Cory gave me actually, but it's really cute and it really like, it looks good on my body. So sometimes I wear it as like a bodysuit and I'll just wear like pants. It's just a fucking leotard. I'm going to keep it. I thrifted this dress from Thrift Giant when I went to Texas with Haley and Rachel. It was $7 and it's just so cute. It's so like dainty. It's just a little bit long. Normally I'm kind of a hoe when it comes to dresses. It's like it has to be above the knee <laughs> or else it just looks so dumb on me I don't know it just makes me look shorter it makes me look Amish I just another dress that I don't know why is in my shirt drawer is this one from so aesthetic I'm definitely gonna keep this I just love the concept of it it's like this two-piece dress that has tabloids all over it I'm pretty sure they also have a tabloid tube top and tabloid leggings so if you are into the dress they have those so I'm gonna keep that too this shirt I thrifted because I was at a thrift store and you know when you're feeling like defeated and you're like I have to buy something like I have to find something Good. So I just bought this and it was full length and I cut it and it's just like so ugly I think it's cuter now that it's cut. I really have not worn this once. No. Bye <laughs> My Ariana Grande shirt. I'm gonna keep Air Apostle shirt Rihanna gave to me and I really I just took it because like more t-shirts Whatever, but I really haven't worn it. So I'm gonna get rid of it. This had to be a ho shirt I thought that I liked more when I first got it, but I think I like it less But I think I'm gonna keep it still It's just annoying that it's kind of see-through and this like scrunches up so much on your body that it's just like it's so annoying but I'm gonna keep it. I like the thing is I just want to like get rid of all my clothes and then start fresh But then I wouldn't have anything to wear because I'm not rich I'm not gonna be able to buy clothes right now written and directed by Quentin Tarantino Honestly, I know I just got this in a haul I'm gonna declutter that because I don't know who the fuck Quentin Tarantino is I know he's a I know who wrote Pulp Fiction. I know that he really likes violence. Oh my god This blues banana shirt. I'm gonna keep this. It's really comfortable I got off of Depop, but it's about you know the, the show Arrested Development their banana stand. Oh this shirt I got off of Depop. It's like a really oversized Betty Boop shirt and it's really cute with like black fishnet and um, like black Doc Martens or just like any really kind of like dark chunky boot. I love this shirt. This is from Brandy. I love polo shirts like this. I wore it in one of my lookbook videos. I'll check that out. I'll have it linked up here. I'm gonna keep that. This shirt I got in Costa Rica. I love this shirt. It's just black. It has elephants on it. It's like scrunchy. Another shirt that I thrifted. I think I'm gonna declutter this. It looks cute when it's like tucked in and then pulled out a little bit. But I just, I really, I've worn this like once. Um, But it's just like this lace up shirt. I feel like it would look really cute on my cousin. And I remember my cousin wanted it. Damn, I'm sorry, Liv. I should have let you have it. <laughs> I should have let you buy it. This shirt, I'm pretty sure I'm selling on Poshmark, so if you want to go buy this. Also, all the clothes here, I will, or most of them, not all of them, I will be trying to sell them on Poshmark. So if you want to go check that out, you can go check out my Poshmark. It'll be in the description. I love Poshmark because they just, they have like Nike and Adidas, and they just have like so many great brands. And it's, I don't know, it's great that you can get them all for such a cheap price. So yeah, if you want to get this shirt it's from garage it's kind of like it's a maroon off the shoulder it's really cute it has like lace detail at the bottom it's really cute um, so if you want to get that. This shirt is from Abercrombie, I think. And again, I haven't worn it in a while. I might try to sell it, but also I low-key have like sentimental value with it because I used to love this shirt. This shirt, I love. This is from Garage. It's really cute. I remember I was about to sell this on Poshmark, but then I didn't because I realized that it was too cute. 
I'm such a bitch. I might sell it, honestly. Because it's cute, but I don't need it, you know? Oh, but it's so cute though. <sighs> I need to mull this one over. So I'm gonna fold up all my clothes. We're gonna see how much room we have, and then maybe we'll move on to this, or maybe we'll look in my closet. I have a bunch more shirts over here. So we'll see, or we'll just see if this video is long enough. Uh, okay, so I found more shirts, and I decided that in this video, I'm just gonna be doing my shirts because if you guys wanna see another declutter video, you can give this video a thumbs up, and then maybe Poshmark will get the memo that they should sponsor me again. This tank top thing from Forever 21, it's actually really cute. I think I'm gonna keep this too. I got it a really long time ago in like their lingerie section, or maybe it's just their sleep section, but like, I don't know, they mostly just sell bras. This Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle shirt I thrifted, and I've never worn it, even though I feel like it's so cute. I just never, I never watched the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle, so I feel like I don't have the right to wear it, you know? I'm gonna declutter it, and you'll see it on my Poshmark. This shirt from Forever 21 is really cute. I got it a really long time ago, but it has like little holes. It's really cute for like the beach. So I'm gonna keep that. I just thrifted this shirt when I was in Texas. I think it's so dope. Like if I were to tie it up in a little bow right here with some black ripped shorts and then like black small sunglasses, it just looks so classy. It was literally $2. I love this shirt. I think it's so cute. And then this Coca-Cola shirt, I actually got like a full t-shirt when I went to the Coca-Cola factory a few years ago and I cut it because this is just so much cuter, but I haven't worn it. Uh, I'm gonna keep it. This shirt I never wear, but Rihanna really likes it. So I think I'm gonna give it to her because it is really cute, but I just never wear it. This shirt I wanna keep. It's from Zaffle. This shirt is so cute. I got it from H&M, and I really, like, I wanna keep it just because it's so cute, but I haven't worn it in so long. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna sell it. I'm gonna sell it. Oh, and then this is, like, a little cropped hoodie thing. I got it from my, like, Tana Mojo W outfit. I'm gonna keep this, too. I got it from Shein. I feel like I ordered it off of Romwe, but it says Shein. I don't think I've ever bought anything from Shein before. Yeah, I'm gonna keep that too. Here's a pile of the stuff that I am decluttering. You will hopefully see all of these on my Poshmark. Either they're gonna be up now or hopefully they'll be up in the next week. Just keep an eye out. Follow me on Poshmark. My username is right here and everything will be down in the description below. I should probably put this on my face. I'm not wearing any makeup right now. I'm really sorry. So yeah, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and maybe we'll do some more decluttering videos in the future, even if Poshmark Mark doesn't sponsor the video. I enjoy this and I feel like it gives me a reason to go through my clothes. Otherwise, I feel like I'm just wasting my time, you know? <laughs> so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment, rate, subscribe, and you know what? And keep on decluttering.